guys, Jeremy Fragrance here, the number one fragrance icon. <laughs> 10 fragrances for the rest of my life. So if I could only take 10 fragrances with me on an island, so to say, one of those would be Reflection Man. All of these fragrances are natural in the sense that they're generally at least smelling like they usually only mostly would use natural ingredients. This one is fantastic. This is a floral fragrance for men, which is unusual to have floral fragrances for guys. It's a big compliment, Gary. It's super sexy. <sighs> of course, my fragrance. They are no in particular order, but this is ultimately the most important one. My fragrance I would take. Office for Men, my first release. I would also take Jean Paul Gaultier Le Mal. This is the Le Mal Terrible, but I mean the actually the normal Jean Paul Gaultier Le Mal. That one was the first fragrance that I was really wearing a lot. Ah, I love it, bro. Man, it's crazy. It's crazy. I don't ever have to work again in my life because I'm doing this stuff. It's sick. And this takes me back to being a 15 year old or whenever I started wearing fragrance. It's crazy, man. You can be your own superstar type of guy in your discipline. All right, the next one would be Orange Sanguine. It even says 91% of ingredients of natural origin. Interesting. That one is a good one. It smells like orange juice. It's my... I love it a lot. I love it a lot. I gotta say. I do love it a lot. Ah, this smells gorgeous. It's, it's an artistic fragrance. It's not a super sexy panty dropper fragrance, but it's super art type of... This is what's possible in the fragrance industry. The next one. Dior Homme Intense. Oof. What a beast, man. What a beast. Dior Homme Intense. So gorgeous. And this has iris. Yes, this gets this lipstick thing. But what many people forget or don't know, this has a strong cardamom note, which brings the seductive sweetness to it. Because iris alone, for the fragrance experts out there, you know it. It smells like wax. It smells not so interesting. But he, this guy, the original formulation, Olivier Polch, the superstar, now works for Chanel. And he made Joram Intense. He also made Spice Bomb. He was part of La Vie Belle team. He is the king of creative yet mainstream fragrances. Joram Intense. Victor Androff Spice Bomb. Gotta look up what Olivier Polch did. This one. I would keep, of course, Aqua di Gio Profumo because before I released my fragrance, I said this is the best fragrance for men. And then came my fragrance. Same perfumer and, of course, from my current collection that I have right here, I would keep this one also. By the way, I heard it's discontinued, so possibly it's smart to get a bottle of this. Creed Aventus I would keep. This is a milestone fragrance in the sense that it was one of those fragrances that also made me super popular on the internet, Creed Aventus. I think they sold thousands of bottles because of me speaking about that fragrance. Next one, La Nuit de l'Homme, Yves Saint Laurent. Yeah, my third video or fourth or fifth was about this fragrance. It went viral and again, thankful to this early memories. You don't forget who made you big. I don't forget who were the first people that invited me or the first brands that paid me stuff. And this one is just gorgeous. Just also on the way how it smells. It's so good. Cardamom, lavender, bergamot. It's so, so good, guys. Next one. Bleu de Chanel, of course, we want to have a Chanel in here. And the last one, not so important, but this reminds me, yeah, of a good time in Miami Beach, where I will go soon back again. I'm not vaccinated, so 
it's not so easy. Although I could just go like this, but I do want to look you in the in the in the in the eyes, so to say, and not trick the system and just going there with however I want to. In any case, this reminds me of Miami Beach. I love it. Parfums de Mali, sadly, a super strong summer citrus fragrance. Thank you for watching. And I got a discount code for my brand. Not many bottles are left from different SKUs. I think almost all 10 mLs are gone. I think almost all 50 mLs are gone from office, definitely. And, and date, not so many. Well, the women's are still left. In any case, use the discount code TikTok66. Gives you 66% discount on my fragrance brand at 266 euros, meaning it deducts 66% and you're left with not a lot. And yeah, so go for that. Fragrance.1, TikTok66. Thank you. I love you. Bye, guys.